ITV is set to carry out an external review into why Philip Schofield left this morning earlier this month. A letter sent from ITV Chief Executive Dame Caroline McCall has been sent to Culture Secretary Lucy Fraser, DCMS Committee Chair Dame Caroline Dinanage, and Ofcom Chief Executive Dame Melanie Dawes. The letter, obtained by PA, referred to wider stories about this morning, including allegations of a toxic culture by drive. Ron Singh who used to regularly appear on the show as an expert. The letter read, You will have seen the significant media coverage concerning Philip Schofield. As you would expect we take the matter extremely seriously and have reviewed our own records over the weekend. These show that when rumors of the relationship between Philip Schofield and an employee of ITV first began to circulate in late 2019-slash-early 2020 ITV investigated. Both parties were questioned then and both categorically and repeatedly denied the rumors, as did Philip's then-agency YMU. In addition, ITV spoke to a number of people who worked on the This Morning and Wider Daytime team and were not provided with, and did not find any evidence of a relationship beyond hearsay and rumor. Given the ongoing rumors, we continued to ask questions of both parties, who both continued to deny the rumors, including as recently as this month. Don't miss! Naked Attraction fans swoon for MILF as she bears all, reaction, Holly Willoughby to step away from this morning after Schofield's exit, insight, Naga Manchetti replaced on BBC Breakfast Days after she admits constant pain, latest, there has been a lot of inaccuracy in the reporting so I thought it would be useful to set out some facts. The letter goes on to state that the former employee Philip admitted to having an affair with has been offered support throughout. It continued, the ITV employee was aged 19 when he first did work experience at this morning in 2015 and 20 years old when he applied and succeeded in securing a job as a runner on the show. He subsequently applied for and was successful in securing a promotion to Lou Swimmin in 2019. He left High TV in 2021. As you would imagine given the social media scrutiny of him, we have offered him our support throughout this period and indeed are still doing so. The employee has made it clear that he does not wish to be named or identified in connection with this matter. We would be grateful if you would be mindful of this. According to the letter, ITV has instructed Jane Mulcahy KC, of Blackstone Chambers, to carry out an external review to establish the facts. She will review our records and talk to the people involved. This work will also consider our relevant processes and policies and whether we need to change or strengthen any, the letter went on. ITV also said that an external review was conducted following a complaint made by Drive. Ranj and found no evidence of bullying or discrimination. The letter added. There have also been wider stories about this morning including about a former This Morning presenter Dr. Ronge. We were sorry to read his statement. We are fully committed to providing every opportunity for anyone who works with us to raise any concern or comments they may have. Following a complaint made by Drive. Ronj, we appointed an external and independent advisor to carry out a review. This external review found no evidence of bullying or discrimination, 